welcome back to my channel. How are you guys all doing today? So today is Monday. I want to say it's July 20th. Honestly, it's so hard for me to keep track of the actual dates. I always have to check like what date is today, but I think today is July 20th and something new, this is totally not related to today's video, but I'm going to mention it anyway, but something new that I've been doing at the start of my day when I'm still in bed, just like about to get up is I'll set an intention for the day. Just one word that I want to help carry me through the rest of the day and be like the focus. And today's was focus actually. And I am getting stuff done. It's kind of a little bit crazy when you set the intention for the day and it just helps you navigate your day better. I don't know, try it out. But anyway, like I said, today's video has nothing to do with intentions or focus. Today's video, I am gonna be talking all about glowing products that work beautifully for my skin tone. By the way, hear that noise? That's the laundry, so if you hear that, ignore it. But yeah, I have a lot of products in front of me, like seriously, a lot, a lot, a lot of products. And as always, I did try them out on my skin tone. I'm wearing every single product I'm gonna be sharing today on my face, and it works so beautiful for my skin tone. And if you're close to my skin tone, you guys are gonna love this as well. So, without further ado, let's get into the video. So, I think I'm gonna do this format as I normally do my videos, in the order of application. And the first product, I have to give a shout out to is the black girl sunscreen this is SPF 30 and I love this sunscreen you guys are always looking for recommendations from me for SPF products that are affordable but very high quality this right here is it fab and let me just tell you this brand is incredible because no matter what your skin tone is this is gonna go on completely clear which I love this is the consistency of it honestly this really reminds me more of like a face moisturizer than an actual SPF. You can see you blend it into your skin and it blends out completely clear. It just disappears on the skin and it is so hydrating. So if you're looking for a hydrating SPF product that you can also double as a face moisturizer, this is great. Deserves so much more hype. Love that brand. All right, now I wanna talk about a tinted moisturizer. I've been trying out actually quite a few different tinted moisturizers. If you follow me on Instagram, if you don't, why not? I will leave my uh, Instagram handle right here. But I have been talking about a lot of different tinted moisturizers on there. And one that I really, really, really have been enjoying and kind of like reaching for over and over again is the Laura Mercier Tinted Moisturizer. This is the Natural Skin Perfector. This also has SPF 30 and the color match is beautiful. I'm going to be very honest with you guys though and just say that I still love more than any other tinted moisturizers I've ever tried. Ever, and that's a big statement. I love my next one. I really, really love it. I'll pop a picture right here. But I've talked about it like 30 times, so I don't want to focus on that. I do want to talk about this because it's brand new to me and I want to introduce you guys to a new product. And I really like this. It's a very lightweight moisturizer. It goes on almost like a face cream and blends out beautifully. All right, moving on. Let's talk about a bronzer because I feel like summer is all about bronzers and like beautiful bronze skin and I am so into bronzers that have a little bit of a sheen right now and I want to talk about this one from Becca I really hope that this is still available I've talked about this a bunch in the past as well and honestly like holding this up next to my face it really doesn't even look like it's gonna show up on my skin but it does you can see I contoured my face very slightly with this today but this has like a very slight glow to it and it adds a beautiful glow to the skin as well. Moving on to, let's talk about a blush. And I've also talked about this before. This is from Jouer. But anyway, this is the blush duo in the shade Darling. And again, looking at this on my monitor, I'm like, this is not even gonna show up on my skin. But of course it does. And you can see I'm wearing a combination of actually both of these, but majority of this one right here. And it adds such a nice, like, pink tint on my cheeks it's beautiful all right now let's talk about a highlight this is from bare minerals such a good everyday highlight that again is perfect for all year round and you can really kind of build it up to be very intense or you can keep it more natural not really natural but you know what i mean like not as intense as i've done today 
let's talk about let's talk about an eyeshadow and this has kind of been the eyeshadow that i've been wearing on rotation i just talked about it on my instagram as well and i got so many questions about it and it is this beauty right here from mac okay do you guys remember mac's woodwinked eyeshadow let me tell you that eyeshadow was one of the best sellers back in the day i don't know if it still is and I remember when I used to work at MAC, everyone that looked like me would come in and just ask for woodwinked eyeshadow. And this is honestly an even more shinier, pigmented version of woodwinked. It is so pretty. You can see I have this on my eyes, kind of like all over my lid and also in the inner corner. And I really feel like this almost, like at least in person, it almost looks like my eyeshadow is wet. It's so beautiful very wearable all right i totally forgot to talk about this little guy here but i have to mention this because this is such a cool product to add a beautiful glow to your skin from my understanding this is kind of like a liquid highlight but i like to use this as a makeup primer on days when i don't want to wear a lot of makeup but i just want a beautiful healthy glow on my skin i'll apply this a little bit like on the high points of my face then i'll go in with a little bit of concealer and that's really it i'll just apply some blush after that but that's really it. I don't use any foundations. And this adds such a nice glow. You can also use this on top of your makeup with your fingers as an actual highlight. You can also mix it in with your foundation. You can also mix it in with your moisturizer. Loads of uses for this. Such a great product. Love the champagne tone. And I especially love it right now in the summertime. Let's kind of talk a little bit about some perfumes. By the way, I have a blog post, which I will link in the description box below. And I talk about some of my favorite perfumes there. I've talked about the same perfumes, like I said, for so long. So I wanted to switch it up and also mention these two perfumes that I am really enjoying for this summertime. Normally, I prefer perfumes that are very intense, sexy, Feminine, that's how I like my scents to be. I, I do like some like floral scents, but mostly I just love that like very intense scent, if you guys know what I'm talking about. And these are definitely very different, but I really like them. So this is the first one from Burberry. But can we just talk about the packaging? The packaging is so cute, and it's actually not too big, not too small, but you can throw this in your bag and take it on the go as well. And oh, it smells so nice. I will say with this perfume, I have noticed, and actually even this one, that these aren't my most long-lasting perfumes, but I just find them so light and refreshing, especially right now, so I wanted to recommend them to you. And then this one from Erin is the Linen Rose. Oh my gosh, this just smells like so fresh clean, floral, and just girly. So these are my two go-to summer scents at the moment that I wanted to recommend. And I definitely think if you guys like my perfume recommendations, you guys are gonna love those. Now let's talk about this beauty. And I've mentioned this before, so I'm not gonna go on and on about this. Fam, I'm almost done with this. Uh, this week I'll be done with this. And I love how this adds such a nice glow to my skin. So I'm gonna just move my hair back so you guys can kind of see my chest. And like, look at that glow. I did apply a body moisturizer because I always apply a body moisturizer. And I definitely recommend that you do the same if you're going to use this body glow product or really any other body glow product because it just glides on even easier if you have moisturized, hydrated skin. So I do that first, apply a little bit of this with actually the body brush. I think this is also from Soul yeah, it is. And it adds such a beautiful glow to my skin. And in terms of transfer, if you just kind of let it sit there for a little bit before like actually wearing your clothes, just for a few seconds, it sets in place and then it doesn't transfer. That's been at least my experience. And I really like it. I'm gonna actually work on a whole blog post for you guys sharing some of my other like body glow products. I'm trying out like four other ones right now. I keep going back to this one, but stay tuned for that. That's gonna come up on my blog hopefully sometime this week. All right, we're almost done. I have four more products, three lip products, and then one clean deodorant that I have been loving. I have to say, out of all of the uh, clean deodorants that I have used in the past, because I've definitely made the switch over now, I don't use regular deodorants really at all anymore. I really enjoy this one. I feel like it does a great job in making you just feel refreshed throughout the day, especially in the summertime. Like I said, it's so hot right now on the East Coast. And this is the one I've been using every single day and this is a beautiful job. Just make sure, you know, 
I'm order free and it really does definitely work. Okay. All right, the sun is now going in and out, so perfect timing to almost end this video. But I do have to talk about three lip products that I have been using on rotation and I love them. And I really think you guys are gonna love these as well. So let's start off with this one right here. And I talked about this on my Instagram. Um, I got so many DMs from people being like, Arshia, are you sure the name is correct? Because I cannot find it anywhere online. And it is correct, you guys. It says it right there. 685 Obsessed. So anyway, I DM'd Revlon and I was like, wait guys, what's going on? Is this not available? Is this sold out? From my understanding, this is a limited edition product. I did see it on Walmart and I think it's still available at Walmart. If it's not, it should be coming soon. But I really think that when you can get your hands on this and if you can get your hands on this, you are going to fall in love with this lipstick. It's a perfect everyday nude lipstick that you can wear on its own with a lip liner. Today I actually mixed it with another lip color, stay tuned for that. But it's just a, like such a great nude lipstick. Next up I've got the YSL and this is such a pretty pinky wearable shade. How gorgeous is that? And I have been so into lipsticks that are a little bit more on the shiny side of my for my skin tone right now. And I've been reaching for this and I really like how this looks on my lip. And kind of just adds like a plumping factor, although this is not meant to be plumping at all, but it just like adds so much shine that my lips just look more plump when I apply this. So. All right, last lipstick is from Kaja Beauty. And I actually am wearing a combination today on my lips of this and this together. I applied the, the Kaja first, then I added a little bit of this. And actually, I'm gonna just top it off with this Heart Melter. This is a beautiful shade. It's so unique. It's like this berry pinky shade that's so wearable and it's not like an intense pigmented shade by any means but it adds a really nice bright pink color on your lips and it's so wearable. Alright everyone, that is it for today's video of all of my favorite brown girl glowing products that I love and I think you guys will love as well. As always, I'm going to be linking all these products in the description box below. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did, please take a quick second to subscribe to my channel. Again, over 60% of you are not subscribed to my channel. It would mean the world to me if you can please just hit the little red button somewhere down here below and subscribe and I am so excited to just go on and work on this video, edit this for you, get this up as soon as possible. I have so many other videos coming your way so definitely do subscribe. Thank you all so much for watching and I'll talk to you soon. Bye!